lot to say. I'm Derek Ray, and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And no question, this ought to be a game that gets pulses racing. It's Australia, and they take on New Zealand. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Chris Wood, good bit of pressing. Well, they would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Milos Degenek. Duke. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. What can they do from here? Well, let's see about the cross. Attending to his defensive chores. Possession one. Good looking sequence. Duke. Now, who can he play it to? And no problems at all for the keeper. Chris Wood. Can he play it in? And that is how to block. Wood. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. And the ball with Bell. Well read to ease the pressure. And he was in the right place to intercept. And the ball with Bell. And good use of advantage, the referee allowing play to continue. But he's decided that no advantage was forthcoming, really. And so it's a free kick. And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. He takes aim. Well, the chance has been missed. No other way to describe it. Aziz Behic. And with that, the first half draws to a close. And the match is underway. And the ball with Bell. But he's decided that no advantage was forthcoming, really. And so it's a free kick. He takes aim. Well, the chance has been missed. No other way to describe it.
So they get the ball rolling in the second half. Even Steven here. So little to choose between the sides. And the emphasis is on creativity. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Now can they counter clinically? All hands on deck. Targets available, cross comes in. And it's in! 1-0, they breach the defence. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Now, let's see what they can do here. Well, they couldn't keep possession. And they need to get tighter here. Oh, could be! What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Behic. Aaron Moy. Duke. Still trailing, but they're upping the pressure. Well, just couldn't play that decisive ball. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. The cross is on. Making sure it didn't get past him. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Well, I don't think that effort remotely qualifies as respectable. And the reason it's off target, because the technique was really poor on that occasion. That's not a good effort. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Oh, frustration for those waiting in the middle. He has time to play it over. Able to get a body in the way. Well, the fans are driving their team on here. But can they respond with a goal? Time is running out. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left, and just one goal between the sides. They get forward, but time is very much against them here. Simple catch, really. And we are going to have two additional minutes. Happy to take on the shot.
Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. And there's the whistle, all even at the end of 90 minutes. And now they get the ball rolling. And the ball with Bell. But he's decided that no advantage was forthcoming, really. And so it's a free kick. He takes aim. Well, the chance has been missed. No other way to describe it. 